Hello everybody, this is Matthew Options. Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna discuss with you about my opinion on Age of Empires 4. When I was a teenager, and when I when I was a teenager, I was always excited of a, the Age of Empires 4 development, and, and someone told me that it was finished developing, but I don't think it came out. When I was a when I was a kid, when I, when I was a kid, I used I saw my grandfather play Age of Empires through the Congress expansion pack. And I was um, I, I was curious on how the game works, so we so I asked him to, to, to play it with me, to teach me how to play it. I was living in Naperville at the time. My mom and I were living with my grandparents at the time, and I was a little kid. And my mom was at work, and while she was at work, my grandpa taught me how to play the game, and and I and I won the game on my first try, and that's where where I started becoming an, becoming and that's where I became a fan of strategy games. I got Age of Empires two, the original version. I got Age of Mythology, then I got Age of Empires, my, and then my uncle play, got me Age of Empires 3. <sighs> and I had all the expansion packs at the time. And don't get me wrong, they were really good to play. And I, I used a couple of cheats to, to advance the campaigns, because I'm not very, very skilled. I will always be a fan of the Age of Empires, the Age of Empires franchise. I, I also got the Age of Empires original game as well. I did okay with it. You know, it wasn't perfect, but it is what it is. I heard, that, and then I heard that Age of Empires Four is coming out soon, but it didn't really come out. I, someone told me that it was done, and I was in high school at the time. I was wrong. I also saw this timeline, book timeline, where it had Age of Empires, had all, Age of Empires One through Five, and after they were they were releasing the definitive editions for Age of Empires One, Three, and One, Two, and One, Two, and Three, and the Age of, Age of Mythology. Um, extended edition in 20, 2013, they released a trailer for Age of Empires 4. When, when I, and when I saw it, I was kind of excited and disappointed at the same time. It looks like a rebooted nostalgia version of Age of Empires 2. Yes, it's set in, in, in the post-classical period, featuring an expanded medieval era starting earlier and ending towards the edge of the Renaissance period. Yeah. <sighs> It's it's like they didn't even try to make it into. In the Age of Empires one, they the the game was set in the era during the rise of Rome and the Greek times, Egyptian times, way back before the medieval times. This is about like ancient Egyptian, ancient Greece, rise of Rome and all that, and then Age of Empires two was set in the medieval age, medieval ages, Renaissance period. And then Age of Empires 3 was set in the Industrial Revolution and the Revolutionary War, the New World, Pirates, Circle of Ossus, Trains, <laughs> Cannons, all that. Age of Empires 4, in, when I saw Age of Empires 4 and Age of Empires 5, 5, I knew that Age of Empires 4, 4 was set in, in the modern warfare era, along with the World War I, World War II, Vietnam War, Cold War, and then the War on Terror. With, with tanks, airplanes, jets, aircraft, carriers, submarines, battleships, nuclear war, and Age of Empires IV. That's what Age of Empires, what, that's what Age of Empires IV should have been. For a lot of, for a lot of people. There are, there are some people who, who prefer an Age of Empires IV modern warfare game. And then Age of Empires V was supposed to rep was supposed to set into the future, like a century later, where you, where you have futuristic lasers, futuristic hovercraft, jet hover, like like jet packs, and futuristic laser swords and spaceships and futuristic ships and robots, aliens. I'm guessing armored suits that. Age of Empires V, in a way, like Star Wars. It, it's like a futuristic, futuristic time with all these, all just futuristic ships, and it's like Halo and Star Wars and Battlestar Galacta, uh, Star Trek. That ideal version of Age of Empires V, in my opinion. But Age of Empires IV was just nothing more than a rebooted Age of Empires II. It's it's like they didn't even try. To make it 
much more nostalgic than the Age of Empires 2 nostalgic crap. No, don't get me wrong. The, the, when I saw the gameplay trailer and the original trailer, they looked pretty good. The graphics look okay. It does look a little cartoonish, and then they do set in the in the Dark Age, Feudal Age, Castle Age, Imperial Age, that tra traditional classic Age of Empires 2 shtick. I, I do like it, but but it just doesn't fit Age of Empires 4. It, it, it's, the Modern Warfare setting fits more... For Age of Empires four, for Age of Empires four, than Age of Empires two, reboot in my opinion. And, and a lot, I, I, I knew that some people on Facebook, probably, I, I, I talked to some people on Facebook that some of them don't even like it. Some, of, some of it thinks, some, some of them think it's, think the graphics are a, bit, a little bit cartoony, and some of them w w are worried that they could be disappointed in, in the population population limit. In the Age of Empires two definitive edition, they had like a fifty popula five hundred population limit. In Age of Empires 3 Definitive Edition, it has like 200 population. They could have just added up to like 700 population. But they did, but they didn't do that. In Age of Empires 4, they could have had it more to like 900 and a 900 population limit. With resources of food. If, if Age of Empires 4 was set into the modern warfare era, like during the, ninth, during the ninth, 20th century and 20th, first century, early 21st century, then they could have had had resources sources, sources like food, wood, um, iron, steel, um, oil, electricity, um, like uh, sunlight, sunlight, I guess, and coal, you know, and then there's are there other resources too for you that would fit with Age of Empires Four? I know that Age of Empire Earth Two did did an expand expanded version of there some more resources. And here's the worst part: Age of Empires Two Definitive Edition had more civilizations than Age of Empires Four. It's planned to have eight. That's messed up. It's it's like it's like Age of Empires Three didn't have enough civilizations, and. Age of Empires 1, Age of Empires, Age of Empires 3, and Age of Empires 4 will have less population than Age of, Age of Empires 2. Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition is much more is clearly much more popular than any of the, of the other games. And I like all of them, except for Age of Empires 4, which I think is just meh, in my opinion. I would love for love for Age of Empires 4 to succeed. I hope the game goes well. It won't please everybody. If you like Age of Empires 4, that's fine. If some of you hate Age of Empires 4, that's fine too. Me personally, I love it and I hate it. I'm happy that this Age of Empires 4 is coming out. I, I'm happy that they're finally releasing it. I just wish that it was made in a different time in a future time period. In, in the next time period after the Age of Empires 4 period. Age Empires 3 period. And it's just ridiculous. And, and, and I can't believe it. They 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 they, they are so creatively bankrupt that they wouldn't even bother to try setting in, in the modern warfare setting of World War One, World War Two, World Vietnam War, Cold War, modern modern war on terror. It's just I, this game is gonna is gonna is gonna be a, is, in my opinion will will be will will have mixed reviews on the Age of Empires Four game, just like Age of Empires Three had mixed reviews back when, when it was made in twenty oh five. And I like the designs of Age of Empires 3, mind you. I, I, I discovered Age of Empires 3 when I was a kid and, and, and when, when Fry's was around. But Age of Empires 4 is not going to be... And, and, and if you replace all of the medieval units with the Modern Warfare units in the Age of Empires 4 gameplay trailer, I would definitely enjoy it. And I wish the graphics would have been would have been improved either way, but still. And I heard that they're going to release the American Civilization in Age of Empires 3 Definitive Edition, but due to, my, due to the lack of... Uh, Due to the lack of storage in my computer, it is highly, highly unlikely that I'm ever gonna gonna do that. I don't want to crush my computer, so I'm just gonna enjoy the gameplay videos on YouTube. That would be interesting, and 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 and, and I did enjoy the and I did and I did find and I did and I was a little ha excited for the gameplay trailer though. I I did like I did like it, and they had that original. Da -da 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 that Age of Empires 2 theme in Age of Empires Age of, Age of Empires 4. They did they did that with Age of Empires 3 as well. And 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 in and in the intro in Age of Empires 1, but they didn't have it in, in the main menu, which is unfortunate. But um either way, I hope it succeeds.
and this game won't please everyone. And if you, and if you try to please everyone, you please no one. But I wish that they could have made the game in a, in a modern setting. But I, did I just repeat myself? I probably did. God, I hate repeating myself. I hate. You're gonna have to ignore my mom because I can. You probably could hear her in the back. If you enjoy the game, if you get it, I heard it comes out this fall. And if you decide to get it, and if you enjoy the game, that's great. And if you don't like the game, you, you can you can return it and get your money back back if you want. So that's pretty much it. Um, if you like this video, um, give it a like. If you don't like it, give it a dislike. You share your comments in the comment section down below. And I'm not here to please everybody. And if you try to please everybody, please no one. Share this video with everybody you know and subscribe to my channel. And give it give a notification. You press on the notification bell for future content. And Age of Empires 4, Age of Empires 4, I hope you succeed. And if you don't succeed, oh well. It's not a perfect game, but hey, it is what it is. I'm Matt the Optimist. Peace the frell out.